So how many of you guys remember The Hitchhiker's Guide to the Galaxy, the radio series? Yes, yes, nerds. Well, in that show, there are a race of aliens that have a peculiar quirk. When a need arises, they evolve really quickly. So for example, if they're reaching for some sugar to put in their coffee, as they go to reach for it, they'll evolve and become something that has giant arms. Oops. That has giant arms. And we all know the biology geeks in the room are probably screaming. I can hear you, I want to swear. The biology, is scre the biology geeks are screaming, that's not evolution, not even a little bit. And they're right, that's transformation, that's changing the shape of your body, that's developmental biology. And what's interesting about them is it's actually pretty similar to the way plants grow. Now, animals, they have a fixed body plan. We get two legs, two arms, and a head, and then we get bigger. Plants are constantly developing. They're in a state of flux. A new leaf here, a new branch here, new roots down here. And at some point in their lives, they'll develop a flower, an organ they've never developed before. And this isn't just an odd thing plants do to keep me in a job. <laughs> I wish. This is important to their survival because if an animal needs food, if I need food, I have to get up off the couch and I have to go to the fridge and I have to stand there like this for about 20 minutes. A plant is stuck where it is. So it has to respond to its environment by changing the way it develops. So if it needs food, it has to produce more leaves so it can photosynthesize for sugars, or it has to produce more roots so it can extract nutrients out of the soil. Now, this plastic development, as we call it, the ability to keep changing your shape, means that if you look at a plant, you can see its entire life history in its body plan. You can see where one branch was obviously growing into the dark and didn't do very well, so it stopped growing or has been damaged and fallen off. You can see where the roots have gone down into something solid because they've stopped and had to develop a different way. And this is totally different from anything animals do. Can you imagine what it would be like if you grew a new arm whenever you needed one? Back to Hitchhiker's Guide to the Galaxy. The aliens, when they reach for something, when they develop their giant arms, they might develop into something that can't drink the coffee. The arms might not be able to bend at the elbow. They might not be able to drink anything. And this is the same for plants. When they're stressed, they can develop into something that can't grow as fast. And this is a big problem for us, because if they can't grow as fast, we can't get as much food. So this is why we study plant development to look at better ways to grow crops and to feed the world. Thank you very much.